2022 Toyota Venza starting at $34,105. Toyota's stylish 2022 Venza is a fuel-efficient offering in the mid-size SUV arena, but it's smaller and less practical than boxier crossovers, some of which cost less money. A 2.5-liter four-cylinder and three electric motors comprise the Venza's all-wheel drive, hybrid powertrain, which sips fuel better than V6. Powered rivals such as the Honda Passport and the Nissan Murano. Toyota offers a comprehensive suite of driver assistance features as standard and a host of modern amenities, including a slick electrochromic panoramic sunroof, are available too. The Venza's interior is strictly a two-row affair and passenger space is adequate, but buyers will find more rear seat space in the Hyundai Santa Fe and the Jeep Grand Cherokee. The best value of the bunch is the XLE model, which comes standard with front and rear parking sensors, passive keyless entry, and 19-inch aluminum wheels. All Venza models come standard with all-wheel drive, so those who want that feature aren't forced to shell out extra to have it. Engine, transmission, and performance. The Venza is offered exclusively as a hybrid, powered by a setup comprised of a 2.5-liter four-cylinder gas engine and three electric motors which together develop 219 horsepower. All-wheel drive is standard, one of the electric motors powers the Venza's rear wheels, while the gasoline engine and the other two motors work to spin the fronts. During our test drive of the Venza, we found ourselves disappointed by its driving dynamics, and it didn't deliver the smooth and even ride that we expected. At our test track, its acceleration was also mediocre at 7.6 seconds to 60 miles per hour putting it 1.5 seconds off the pace set by the Passport. Fuel Economy and Real World MPG The EPA estimates that the Venza will deliver 40 miles per gallon city and 37 miles per gallon highway, which is almost double the ratings of other two-row mid-size SUVs such as the Passport and the Ford Edge. On our 75-mile-per-hour highway fuel economy test route, we recorded 36 miles per gallon. For more information about the Venza's fuel economy, visit the EPA's website. Interior, Comfort, and Cargo. Based on its dimensions, we expected the Venza's cabin to be slightly roomier than the smaller Toyota RAV4s in terms of spaciousness, but in reality we found the Venza slightly less roomy. Not only is passenger space tighter here than in the RAV4, cargo capacity suffers as well, although most buyers will find it perfectly adequate. We fit 7 carry-on suitcases behind the rear seat and 18 in total with the rear seats folded, versus 10 and 22 for the RAV4. The Venza is the first Toyota to offer the optional electrochromic panoramic sunroof that the company calls Stargaze. With the flip of a switch, the sunroof's glass panels go from transparent to opaque. This impressive feature is something, until now, 
that we've only found on luxury cars such as the Mercedes-Benz SL class. Infotainment and connectivity. An 8.0-inch touchscreen is standard on the Venza and stands proudly atop the SUV's dashboard. A larger 12.3-inch display is optional on the XLE and standard on the Limited. No matter which display is chosen, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Amazon Alexa connectivity are all standard, as well as Sirius XM satellite radio. Upgrading to the larger of the two displays also unlocks in-dash navigation and adds a 9-speaker JBL premium stereo system. When the Toyota Venza resurfaced for 2021 after a six-year hiatus, the mid-size two-row SUV placed very favorably in Edmunds rankings. In large part, that's because it's a hybrid with an impressive EPA-estimated 39 miles per gallon in combined driving. Other SUVs in the class are estimated to return only 20 to 25 miles per gallon. On top of strong fuel economy, the Venza comes standard with all-wheel drive and its hybrid powertrain keeps things quiet and calm for a more luxurious experience. As a hybrid, the 2022 Toyota Venza can be more expensive than some rivals, but owners are likely to recover the initial cost in the form of savings at the gas pump in a short time. In terms of utility, though, the Venza isn't as strong as the competition. The interior space is smaller than average, and the Venza is not rated for towing duties. If you put a higher priority on spaciousness and hauling, you might be better served by one of the Venza's chief rivals, the Honda Passport, Hyundai Santa Fe or Volkswagen Atlas Cross Sport. Our expert trading below spells out in detail where the Venza shines and where it could use some improvement. But overall we consider it a great choice for those looking for more efficiency and luxury.